Alrighty, so I'm just going to give kind of a quick update to some of the games that I'm going to be looking forward to this month. I might make this kind of a new series too, possibly on this channel, just kind of like upcoming games, uh, games I'm looking forward to, or just, you know, simply just, you know, games that are on my radar. Whether or not I get them or not, I mean, I don't know. Like, sometimes I'll be curious about games, sometimes I'll be into certain things. But, uh, again, you know, it fluctuates with me when it comes to gaming. Sometimes there's games that, like, would be on everybody else's radar, but I'm not really into. So, that's all I want to preface this video with saying is that, you know, it's kind of random sometimes. And sometimes I'll do stuff like this, just update videos and stuff. So, without further ado, I'm just going to talk a little bit about... You know, the, the, the Metal Gear Solid Remake, the Metal Gear Solid 3 Delta Remake that is coming out. And if anybody's familiar with Metal Gear Solid, I'm sure everybody kind of understands that it's Hideo Kojima. That's one of his original projects, his games, and uh, Konami. And I don't know if they outsourced this. <clears throat> like, if they sourced it out to somebody else or if Konami themselves did it in-house. I think... I believe Konami did it themselves. I think they're the ones that actually put some of the uh, finishing touches on it, or they're the ones that actually did the remake itself. If not, I might have to be checked on that. You might have to, you know, cite something in the comments or something like that. And again, if you like what you see here, and if you want to see more videos like this or other videos in the future, um, give me ideas in the comment section or like, favorite, and do all those other things. Just kind of keep the video maybe out there. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of interested to see the Metal Gear, the Metal Gear Solid 3, because I wasn't the biggest, like, fan of Metal Gear Solid when I was growing up. I enjoyed certain aspects of it, like action, espionage, like, uh, stuff that was just like, uh, sneaking around and doing stuff. That's like my only experience with it though, is like when I was a kid, I played with, you know, my cousins. And they were helping me with some stuff on it. It wasn't like somebody that really got into it, though. I feel like I was not the right demographic for that kind of video game. I did play a little Splinter Cell from time to time, too. But, again, that was still not a thing. Like, I'm just not really a spy, you know, game guy or anything like that. Like, it's like you're always having to sneak around and do things. Like, I played a little bit of Metal Gear and a little bit of... Uh, what is it like stuff like siphon filter and stuff like that too but never beat any of those games like and those ones aren't as sneaky siphon filter is not really sneaky but but all i'm going to say is uh you know if you're familiar with it metal gear solid 3 you know it's a remake of the original and it was probably one of the best ps2 games that did come out around that time period might be one of the best games that came out for the ps2 actually and just in games in general so, I mean, I do sometimes cite Wikipedia and stuff. I know that's probably not the best source of information. And I know it's kind of cheesy. It might be cheesing it a little bit to just kind of cite stuff like Wikipedia. But this is what I do sometimes. I'm not really that well versed on this game. But I guess it's set in 1964, 31 years before the events of the original Metal Gear. So before the first Metal Gear. And... It's going to be having pretty much all the same mechanics, if not enhanced mechanics, for the new one, the remake. As far as I can tell, there's people talking about it that it's going to have, like, not only just visual enhancements, audio enhancements, and it's going to be upgraded mechanics, too. Like, they're going to improve upon the mechanics, the uh, AI, and all that stuff. So everything you came to know and love, but probably better on, like, a PS5 Pro and all that's going to be Pro enhanced as well, so I have... You guys are wanting to know if it's a pro enhanced if it's gonna have anything like that it's gonna be pro enhanced because I remember seeing that um, I'm just gonna play kind of a little bit of the trailer of this um, or most of, I'll just play the whole trailer so that you guys can get an idea and then there's another game I might talk about here after this stalker 2 which I'm again not really familiar too much with stalker games but I'm kind of, that's kind of on my radar. It's not really like a big one on it, but definitely the Metal Gear because I just pre-ordered that one. Like today, I pre-ordered that one. So I definitely want to see what that's going to look like because I did play the demo for that one 
back when it came out, PS2, you know, but I never finished it. I was not, I mean, I feel like I just want to challenge myself to play a Metal Gear game. And if it's going to be enhanced and better and all that stuff, I think that'll be a great thing to do. So we'll play this here real quick. Let me mute this. Okay, so that gives you pretty much an idea of what you're going to be getting into, and that's just, you know, a gameplay trailer, or not really even a gameplay trailer, that's just a cinematic, and there's gameplay trailers and, like, you know, kind of inside stuff. If you look at other uh, channels or look at other videos that are on here, you can get an idea of what you're getting into with this game. Like I said, it's probably going to be pretty good. It's probably going to be pretty solid. It looks like it's going to be a really solid game, fun time. So... I guess we'll see. I'm probably going to do some streams or something surrounding that game. Like either an overview, first impressions, or definitely playing the game at some point, you know. And I got a pro console coming, which, you know, I don't have it yet, but I should have probably got it this week, but I had some trouble with that. So we'll play, we're just going to talk about Stalker 2 a little bit here. Just, you know, hinting at some things going on. Um,. So these are like, again, games on my radar, just things I'm talking about here. Now, this is actually a Wikipedia on the actual Stalker game. But Stalker 2 is still going to be basically in the, the kind of same category. Um, you know, first-person survival horror franchise. And it's by a Ukrainian developer, uh, GSC uh, Game World. And it's uh, going to be based in Chernobyl. I guess it's like... Like nuclear fallout, nuclear kind of wasteland type stuff, or like certain things are going on. And I don't really know too much about the Stalker series. I know there's like mutants, monsters. Um, it's a survival game. Like there's probably humans and stuff in the game too that you have to, you know, face. And it's going to be like kind of one of those hardcore games if you're, I guess, used to stuff like maybe Tarkov a little bit, but that's multiplayer. This is only a single player game. So. You know, you're trying to gather resources, you're trying to, you know, probably, I don't know, do makeshift stuff, fix stuff, guns and weapons and stuff like that. Um, it looks like a fun game. It looks like a cool game, and if I've never played any of the Stalker games. This is kind of my first endeavor. If I do end up getting this game, it does look like it'll be fun, and the graphics and gameplay and everything looks really cool. Everything looks really neat. And I would probably be interested in something like this. If not, then it's just going to be, you know, the Metal Gear game. But I might not play this on stream or anything. I don't know. I'm not really sure. 
yet if I'm going to get this game. I'm just kind of putting it out there that it, it looks like a really fun game. It looks like it could be really neat. So we'll just play a trailer for this one as well. And that's pretty much probably all I'm going to do for this whole video. Uh, yeah, there's not much else I really have to say. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Um, that's pretty much all I'm going to probably show on this video. It does look like it'll be a really fun game. And I think both Metal Gear Solid 2 and this game, unless they delay this, but I'm pretty sure they're both going to be November 20th or around November 20th. If I do remember correctly, the person, the person I watched talking about Metal Gear Solid 3, Metal Gear Solid 3 uh, Remake, was either it was November 20th I believe that's what they said um, I have a fact check it to really make sure but I think that I've seen the number somewhere um, but that's what they're saying and uh, unless that's just a complete rumor maybe it hasn't been announced yet but I think it is and this is stalker 2 so it's I guess they're gonna be releasing around the same time which I don't know they're both big releases I'm not sure if they would on the same time but I guess that's what they're doing so um, this one's I think gonna be just for Xbox platforms and PC and then MGS 3 is basically PlayStation mostly not sure if it'll have any other releases I don't think it does I'm pretty sure it's an exclusive so so yeah that's what we have to look forward to I don't I'm not really looking forward to too many other games I usually look forward like you could do updates I might do updates on like all the games at some point like maybe I'll start moving on to like like an, an entire game update thing but I'm just sticking to the games I personally want to get into possibly and just talk about them a little bit but that's about it so um like I said subscribe like do those things if you choose to and I think that's all I'm gonna have you guys have a good one